back to back, uh, any changes for you in terms of time management or rotation wise? Um, not at the moment. We'll, we'll, feel, we'll get a feel for it during the game, but we'll see how it goes. What changes do you make? How do you approach defensively when you're facing two guys who are top 10 in assists that can dish the ball and find your teammates so well? You know, both, both of those guys, like you said, they, they can score. Um, they do a really good job of getting into the teeth of the defense and kicking out to open teammates. Uh, you know, we just have to do a good job of, of making everybody take tough shots. Uh, you know, there's times when we need to limit Trey Young's uh, touches, uh, try to put pressure on him. But once again, guys that touch the ball as much as uh, DeJounte, DeJounte and Trey does, you got to make them take tough shots all game long. So guys, kind of minutes distribute a little differently last night. Did that have anything to do with the fact that you're playing tonight? As far as Najee not, maybe not playing as many minutes as he usually does. No, it had more more to do with the fact that we got, we got Brandon and Herb back. And, um, you know, kind of guys are kind of going into their normal slots. Um, and then filling the game. Brandon had it going right for a little bit longer stretches. Uh, so, we would like to have a set time, but it didn't always work that way. Hawks, uh, run pick and roll is just about as much as any team in the NBA. What are the challenges of, of defending that? You know, we got to show them different looks um, without me giving away what we want to do. <laughs> <laughs> you got to show them different looks. You, you got to be aggressive at the point of, of, of attack. <clears throat> and then, you know, the defense behind you. We all have to be kind of pulled in, ready to get out to those shooters. So just make it tough. Uh, Z with a 50 just in certain spots in the second half last night. Z, did he go tonight? Yeah, so as far as I know, he's going to go. How much are you still tinkering with rotations and trying to figure out how those second combinations work and then how, how you want to use the, I guess the big guys with the stars in that second group? It's always evolving um, based on availability. There's times where we, we're at full strength and we kind of know our rotations. When we don't, we got to kind of figure it out on the fly, uh, what's working for us, what's not working for us. Um, against the Lakers, we had Herb and uh, Brandon out, so Najee and Trey played a ton of minutes for us. With those guys back, they may not play as many, <clears throat> as many minutes, but they're still you know, a vital uh, part to what we do. Well, he faces DeJounte in the division four times a year. I know you're glad to see him in the East. Uh, is it the same guy on tape that you saw in San Antonio? He does some things uh, on the floor that's similar, but it looks like, um, you know, he's just playing with a different spirit, uh, so to speak. Uh, you know, he's offensively, he's coming down and, you know, he has, it seems like he has a bit more freedom to take some shots that, you know, maybe he didn't necessarily take in San Antonio, but uh, he, he's very similar to, to what he did in San Antonio defensively. You know, you watch the New York game, he, he single-handedly changed that game with his defense, uh, getting steals in the passing lanes, making plays for his teammates. Uh, so, you know, he, he's, he's playing at a high level. You know, we need to do a good job on him tonight. Coach, going back to rotations for a second, uh, what have you seen from Dyson Daniels this year, both good and bad, and what does he need to do to earn more consistent minutes? Dyson has been great. Uh, everything that we've asked him to do, he's handling it well. Uh, when he gets an opportunity to play, he takes full advantage of it. And um, he'll, he'll continue to earn minutes as, as the season progresses, but there's no concerns on our part. I think he's going to be a huge part uh, to our program. All right, thanks, Coach. Okay, thank you, guys.